Look at the bloody inlet there, it's massive. Marsburger Strass. Turn right at these lights, which is on green. Well, it was on green. Jonathan's been running low on fuel for quite some time. We decide we'd better pull over and divert our sat navs to the nearest petrol station. We're going to have to pull over and find some, I think, because otherwise you're, yeah, you don't want to get to a point where you're panicking. Going to pull over here. I don't know what this is the entrance to, but no idea. I love that word, am I? Option. In, we're all charging up. Way. Right, let's. Away we go. Yeah, just that to pull over, uh, put an extra layer on. Uh, it's gone a bit chilly. It's, well, the air blowing through the mesh right onto my skin. A bit too much, so just put a layer on. Hopefully that'll do the job, it's not a thick layer I put on, but just deflect the wind a bit. It's saying we're going to L549, now if, if that's anything to go off, I think the last L roads we've been on, they've been them dual carriageways. Now if, we, if we're going to a, one of them, there's normally petrol stations around them, or services. Whoa. Something like that, yeah. I've got 85 miles, me. So I'm not panicking yet, but the fact that we know there's nothing on our route for a while, it's and we're in the middle of a forest. <laughs> Cow though, the collar on it. Must be someone's pet. No, oh, he's not playing. I don't get that, mate. You know, with this, the people that they divide up the bikers group, don't they? So if you're a scooter rider, they won't speak to you. If you've got Harley Davidson, they won't speak to you. If you're a sports bike rider, it's like why make divisions when they don't need to be any? If you're on two wheels, just give each other a nod and wave. What's up with you, man? Yeah, it's uh, it's everywhere, isn't it? So. Means something to somebody. Unless there's, I don't know, some event going on or something we <laughs> don't know about. We're proud of it, whatever it is. Wave your flag, you can do, wave your flag for me, I don't mind.
Yeah, well, that's it. I mean, I like them here. I like seeing them here. I like the fact that, you know, like they're in Germany. We see German areas and they've got the German flag out. Good for them. You know, I'm a foreigner in the country, so if I see a German flag, I'm not offended. I expect to see a German flag. I think that's the problem. I'll just hit the nail on the head. Too many people are offended by bullshit these days. I'm offended. Stops everybody doing anything. We're scared of upsetting someone all the time. Like the comedians in the 70s and all that when that were on telly. Yeah, they'd never get away with half at jokes now. They, they took off her. Well, that's the thing. I would, um, have you seen the late, one of the videos for High Flying Birds? You know, Noel Gallagher's band. Have you seen... I don't know if it's his latest song, but one of his songs, it's the... Um, Wheel Tappers and Shunters Club. Have you not seen it? It's really good how they've done it. They've mixed all footage with all the characters that were in that with them on stage. So it's like them in in the Wheel Tappers and Shunters Club on stage. And he, they've even got Bernard Manning introducing them. Up next on stage, now we've got Noel Gallagher and he's all flying birds. And you're like, how have they done that? It's brilliant. It's really good. Get my gloves off ready. Get a little bit ahead of the game. Wedge me gloves in there. I've got behind the guy that's putting about four million gallon in. No, it don't matter. Well, it turns out what he must have said was, watch out, I'm going to reverse and run you over. But in German, obviously. Cheers, mate. That was good of him. Because it looks like... you got to watch it in these German garages. The floors are slippy, really slippy. Slippy floors, ending up with slippy boots. 193.9 a litre. <laughs> oh, important fuel stop then, eh? Well, you had less than me, you put. Super 95, don't, make, don't put diesel in. That doesn't end well. Yeah. Yeah, Super 95. Yeah. Because apparently it's super. Yeah. Hello. Hello there. Number one, please. There you go. Cheers, thank you. Bye now. We're going that way, aren't we? We can't be, we turn. No. That way. <laughs> All right. At the roundabout, third exit. Yeah, it's definitely a little bit wetter here, isn't it? Well, it seems bright though, doesn't it? But the roads are wet and there's a bit of fine spray. My tent, by the way, I put it away, it's absolutely sopping. Yeah, it started raining really heavy. As I just got the poles out and then it just, boom, it come down really heavy and literally within 30 seconds, my tent was swimming, there were puddles in it and everything, but crikey. I shook it and everything and put it away, but it's, yeah, it's pissed through.
so I think uh, when I come to put it up later it's going to be a bit damp so it'll dry out once it's been up well hopefully we're still not if it's not still raining that's a problem now because it's all been folded in on itself wet if I put it up now and it rains it'll probably leak tea gut what well, that means well, there's another Aldi there buggers are everywhere we've got as many Aldis here as they have at home wonder why the logo's different though Frankfurt and Hanover places that we know of bloody hell it's poor shaded here it raw then awesome yeah a bit of a bottleneck here it's building up we must be coming towards uh, another buddy uh, solar farm here they're everywhere I love the solar panels in Germany they're everywhere all over houses, every field at Spur, they've got them boarded out like that. Thing is, eh, they probably pass that saving on to customers before they don't at home. We were, all that promises when they were doing wind farms, yeah, wind farms will be going on. Um, it'll make your bills cheaper. Bullshit. Absolute bollocks. Didn't make them cheaper, made it go up. Because now we've got a perfect cost of all the installation and all that lot, so it's actually costing us. We're not saving anything. A car in the queue decides to change lanes and clips Jonathan's pannier. That's left only, that one. As I go down the line of traffic here, you can see already he's turned his front wheel, ready to change lane. What? What? It's okay, we're all friends. Jonathan's waving at him to say everything's cool. Okay. After all, he only tried to kill him. Holy shit. My ears pop then going down that hill. If they're popping on that hill, imagine what they're like in Austria. They're like deep sea diving. <laughs> We're going along gear, are we? We weren't it. We sat and I didn't mention that. Oh, hello. I know. It's confusing that. Bloody dodge, you know, railway tracks. Slippy as puggery. You don't want to be getting your knee down when you're going over them. <laughs> With a bit of you, your assassin might go a different way, is he? Yeah. He's a killer. The Dutch killer. That'd have been hell of an insurance claim for him filling that. I'm English and I was in Germany, hit by somebody from Holland. Oh, look at that in front. That's quite cool. Just cut in front of me here. I know. City mentality. You say I'm at home. You're all right. You're going to Manchester, Birmingham, London, anywhere, Newcastle. Suddenly, knobhead drivers. It's just a city mentality. Oh, it's changing lane again now. He can't make his mind up where he wants to be. Look at that up there. That guy's. What's with that guy up there? No idea. <laughs> it looked like a real bloke. Yeah, because real blokes stand on big gold balls above traffic and just stand there all day. Yeah, it's a built up place. Look at that big hall. Oh. And this old building in front. 
nice. Dinosaurs, bloody hell, we got them and all. Mega. The big yellow sign that basically says to me, complicated. Second exit, I assume that's straight on, so. And both lanes go straight on anyway. Oh, what the hell? This is well confusing. Oh, that's going right, that, so I want to be in this one. This late, oh no, we're going round. Up here, I think. Well, in the next video, we have problems with tram tracks. Tram tracks in road. Not good. A happy song. Rain has gone and the sun is out. 120, where hey? Speedy roads. Mega tunnels. I've not even going to apologise for it. Oh, look at this. Why wouldn't you like this? this and sat nav issues again. Why don't you send a nasty email to Garmin and say your fucking device is shite? Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is like Scotland all over again. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.